Both of them. <laughs> Don't care. Ich bin Mary und willkommen auf meinem Kanal. Hello everybody, my name is Mary and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I make videos every single day, so make sure you hit that subscribe button and push notifications on for my channel so you never miss a video. I also want to mention my Patreon because I do make extra content on there, bonus footage, deleted footage, early access. So if that's something that's important to you, definitely check it out. Okay, so we are about to dive into the season two final of Dark. I feel like time has flown so fast. I am almost at season three and it is the 30th of June that I'm filming this. And season three just went out about three days ago. So I'm not that late. I'm not that late. On June 30th, I will be starting season three. I won't be finishing season three, but I'm definitely starting it. And that is really exciting because it means I'm finally gonna get some answers and I'm really excited. So let's dive into this episode together. Wow. Bleak, bleak, bleak. Mm, what's that? Oh, it is her. Finally, some confirmation. Now it makes a lot of sense because Elizabeth let her relative, Jonas, go when he, he was um, about to be executed. Because yeah, they're relatives, as we found out through the connection of Noah. Her grandfather. And then who is that lady? The day of the apocalypse. Maybe I can't prove you killed my brother. It'll get you for what's going on here. So he is responsible for the Marburg murder. Alles fängt wieder von vorne an. Die Zukunft fängt an. Ein neuer Zyklus. Oh, they're touching. They're touching. Oh my god. <laughs> some some aunt or nephew action about to get down. Oh my god, is he really gonna do that? Ooh. In the last 12 months, you taught me everything. Oh. Oh. Everything that happened. Everything that will Da draußen gibt es zwei Seiten. Adam und Sigmundus wollen eine neue Welt erschaffen. Du und ich, wir wollen diese retten. Wer ist Adam? <lacht> Darling. You got a lot of catching up to do. Because I want to save you. Ich weiß, was heute passiert wird. Du hast mich am Leben gehalten. Ich bin nur hier wegen dir. Oh, wow. Oh, das kommt so hin. Es wird alles genauso geschehen, wie es immer geschehen ist. Oh, she gets to see her son Mikko growing up. Imagine that, like, knowing that your son ends up committing suicide. Wie kann ich Mikko damit zurückholen? Selbst wenn ich sie erkläre, das ist unmöglich. Du willst gar nicht, dass er zurückkommt. Weil es dich da nicht mehr gibt. Ich wünschte, es wäre so einfach. Die Dinge, die in der Vergangenheit liegen, können nicht erinnern. Jesus. She is such a terrible person. He's always looking at this one picture. I would, I really want to look into that and the and the meaning of the picture. Oh wow. Oh my god. 
Glaube ich also recht. Du hast immer noch nicht verstanden, wie dieses Spiel gespielt wird. Oh mein Gott, das ist... Die Zeit spielt ihr grausames Spiel mit uns. Du glaubst, es ist deine Bestimmung, mich zu töten. Aber das ist ebenso wenig dein Schicksal, wie es meines ist, hier und jetzt zu sterben. Erst wenn wir frei sind von jeder Emotion, sind wir wirklich frei. Erst oh wenn man bereit ist, das zu opfern, was einem das Teuerste ist. Dearest. Charlotte ist deine Tochter. Sie ist Elisabeths Tochter und ihre Mutter. Es gibt keinen Menschen ohne Schuld. Keiner von ihnen hat einen Platz verdient in deinem Paradies. Okay, I need to watch that part again. I need to watch that part again. Okay, I'm going back. I need to watch that part again. Charlotte is your daughter. She is Elizabeth's daughter and her mother. What? Es gibt keinen Menschen ohne Schuld. Charlotte? Is it your daughter? She is Elizabeth's. What? Oh, God. Whoa! This knoten lässt sich nur lösen, indem man ihn voll und ganz vernichtet. Oh my goodness! Wir können unserer Bestimmung nicht entkommen. Oh my God! Agnes. Surely not. <laughs> she just killed her own brother. Oh my god. And Adam knew all along that he had the real pages. I'm I need to rewatch that again. Cause that whole family tree thing is confusing me. So at the end I'm gonna rewatch that bit. That's how the apocalypse happens. They, they dig underneath the ground and uh, probably destroys the town of, out of Vinden. Martha and young Jonas, I got to be Go on. Hug each other. I was going to say. I know. I know. I know. Yeah. Yeah. It's clicking. It's clicking. <laughs> oh my god. She and he, both of them, don't care. I've never been so happy for incest besides John and Daenerys, but. <laughs> oh, that's where Adam went. I can't believe a word that comes out of this guy. Ich bin der Auslöser dafür, dass du zu dem wirst, was ich heute bin. No! No! No. 
Oh God. <laughs> Nein, Frau Doktor. Das ist unser Elefant. Sie haben keine Ahnung, um was es hier wirklich geht. Um was geht es denn wirklich? Es geht nicht um die Vermissten. Es geht um die Zukunft, die Vergangenheit und wie alles zusammenhängt. Tell him. Aufmachen. Nein, bitte nicht. Aufmachen. Nein, das ist falsch. Oh no. Is Katarina gonna go back to the 50s and find Hannah there with Ulrich? I would love if she did that, and I would love to see a showdown between the two ladies. Wow, they both opened it at the same time. Oh my goodness. Oh, wow. She's seeing her mother. Reunitings just get me so emotional, man. Oh, wow. So that is what triggered the apocalypse. <gasps> what? Marta! She's back! And she's darker and a little bit hotter. <laughs> Does she have a haircut? I'm not who you think I am. Marta, das kann nicht sein. Ich verstehe. Wir haben keine Zeit mehr. Oh, Marta's leading this one. And she's got her own device. This is just amazing. What world? Are you kidding? I just finished season two of Dark and my mind is blown. I still need to rewatch that bit with Adam and Noah where Adam reveals a little bit more about Noah's family because I'm still confused. I watched that two times and I'm still confused. Or maybe I need to see a season two family tree just to get my head around it. Maybe I'm just dumb. Maybe I've just taken too many things in, but I definitely need to see a season two family tree. I think I know what triggers me the most and it's definitely having people be reunited. Even when I was reacting to Game of Thrones, anytime a family member got reunited, it would just trigger such emotion in me. And this show is all about people reuniting with one another. At least that's what season two is about. And it's just so emotional seeing Regina being reunited with her 1980s mom, seeing future Elizabeth being reunited with her past mom, seeing Marta and Jonas, both middle-aged Jonas and younger Jonas be reunited, just does something to me, man. It's just so, so powerful, those scenes, especially the acting in it, it just gets you. Well, at least it gets me. And I now know never to trust a single thing that comes out of Adam's mouth. You know, I had a little, a tiny ounce of hope in, I think it was episode four or five, where Adam tells Jonas that he needs to go back into the past and change the moment where Michael, Michael, Michael Kahnwald kills himself. But middle-aged Jonas told us, um, well, at least he told Katarina that that can never be changed. He understands that now because of his birth, that point in time can't be changed. That's just the fate of Mikkel. Poor Mikkel doesn't deserve it. He didn't deserve it. It's such an unfortunate thing that happened to him. And we're finally starting to get some more answers from Alexander's past and what Alexander and Bola were really doing. Finally, like that was the biggest question mark for me in the whole of season one and pretty much the whole of season two, I was always wondering what the hell is Vola's connection to Alexander? Why is he helping him? That still hasn't been answered. The reason why Vola is helping Alexander, but at least we get a little bit more um, than we ever did before. I think season three is gonna be really, really exciting, especially because we now are not only seeing time travel, but we are seeing a completely parallel universe. I feel like season one was a little taster. Season two was all about time traveling and all of the characters exploring time traveling. And now season three is gonna be about this world that Adam has created. We know that because that Marta comes to this world and 
I don't know what she's trying to do with this Jonas. I don't know if this Marta is evil or what her agenda is, but we do know that that parallel world that Adam sought out to create has been created and I'm so excited. I'm so excited for season three. All right, guys, that's it from me. Thank you so much for watching. As always, leave your comments on the season two finale in the comment section below with no spoilers, please. Give this video a thumbs up so I know to make more dark reaction videos. And of course, if you want more content from me, that's available on Patreon, which is linked in the description bar below, as well as all of my social medias if you want to follow me on there. Thank you so much for watching this episode with me and I will see you in my next video. Auf Wiedersehen!